Well, hey there, guys and gals. I'm Colin from FruitsOfSpirit.com, and we've got a story for you today. Today's story is called The Parable of the Net. So Jesus tells us this story a long time ago, and he says that the kingdom of heaven is like a net that someone put into a lake. After some time, they caught all kinds of fish. When the net was finally full, the fishermen pulled it onto the shore. They sat down and they separated the good fish from the bad fish. Then Jesus says, this is how it will be at the end of the world. The angels will come and they'll separate the good people from the bad people. Now this is such a cool story, but before I tell you what it means, I wanna tell you that we're so glad that you're here. It really means a lot to us. And if you guys would consider liking this video as well as subscribing to our channel and ringing the bell, we'd really, really appreciate it. Also stick around to the end of the video to see how you can get a coloring page of the illustration that you're seeing drawn in this video. Okay, this is a cool story, but how do I know that I'm a good person? What's crazy is that Jesus says, none is good but God alone, which means that no one except for God is good. So what does that mean? Does that mean we're all bad people? Well, yes, but there's good news. Jesus lived the perfect life so that he could die for us bad people. The Bible tells us that Jesus was good and he died for the bad that we did. He did it so that we could become good. Isn't that crazy? All that we have to do in order to become good is we have to accept and give our lives to Jesus. Not too long ago, I went fishing with some friends. We went fishing not with nets, but with fishing poles. We got into the boat and we put it on the water and we started to sail across the lake. We quickly realized that it was so, so cold outside, but we decided to continue anyways. We got to our fishing spot and while we were there, we threw out our fishing rods and waited and waited. But after about an hour, we realized we weren't gonna catch anything. And we also realized that we were freezing cold. Our hands were hurting and our ears were hurting because it was so cold. Eventually we gave up and we decided to go back home. You know what's cool about God? Is He's willing to wait for us. He's not like me and He doesn't get too cold or too tired or too exhausted. He's ready for us whenever we are. But the coolest part about Him being ready is that He's not only ready a hundred years from now, but He's also ready today. And if we want to enter into his kingdom and be a good person because of what Jesus has done for us, then all we have to do is give him our hearts today. But how do we do that? Well, all we have to do is talk to him. Did you know that praying is just talking to God, just like you would talk to a friend? And we can do that any time of the day and he's always listening. If you want to be made into a good person because of what Jesus did and enter into his kingdom one day, you can talk to him about that right now. All you have to do is say, God, I want into your kingdom. I want what Jesus did for me. Change my heart and make me new. And that's the parable of the net. I hope that you guys really enjoyed that as well. Like we promised, if you would like to get that coloring page, just go to our website, www.fruitsofspirit.com. We hope to see you there. Also, if you've enjoyed the content, please do consider liking this video as well as subscribing to our channel.